It's almost time, Miss Larry. I just wanted to remind you, it's your board. Oh, Miss Rand, we are going to play ball at recess. Honest, you better get somebody else. Some girl. <laughs> I'm class dismissed. Larry, my name is Chalky. Gosh, you can talk. Sure. And walk. And run. And even jump. Gosh. Ah, oh, that's nothing. Important, Larry. I'm here for a purpose. To do something about your manners. What do you mean, my manners? I'm worried about you, Larry. You need someone to give you some advice. Some advice on how to become a regular guy. Say, who do you think you are? You're just like everyone else. Always picking on me. I don't think I like you. Now, now, Larry. No one wants to pick on you. Hey. Hey, hey, what are you doing? I'm gonna wipe you out. That's what. Look. Look out there. Hey, hey, stop. Look out now. Help. You think you're smart, don't you? My heavens, you are a bad-mannered young man, aren't you? I dare you to come down here and say that. I think we'll continue this little talk from up here. Now, about those manners, I'm afraid you've got to improve them. Yeah? Who says so? I do. And practically everyone else. Everyone who knows you thinks you're rude. Eh... Uh, you're just making that up. People like me are... I'm afraid not, Larry. I guess I'll have to prove that, though, won't I? You're darn tootin'. I dare you. All right. You ask... Let's look, Bill. When you arrived at school yesterday, it wasn't time for class, so you went out to the playground. The other kids were... You can't do that. You're gonna work up like everybody else. Try and take it away from me. Don't argue with him, Jim, a few minutes before the bell rings. Uh, play ball! Okay, throw it a ball. Well, I wouldn't have had time to work up before the bell rang for class. Uh-uh, Larry. That's no excuse. But speaking of the bell for class, I seem to recall that you played ball after the bell rang. Being late for class is another example of bad manners. What's more, you got others into trouble by making them late, too. And Miss Rand. Do you think that her morning isn't busy enough without teaching the same thing twice? Well, gee, I didn't... Me... Well, I didn't... Um, uh, I was wondering, Larry. Uh, you wouldn't erase me if I came down a little. Well, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. I think I can trust you, Larry. After all, <laughs> I'm just trying to be your friend. I guess I'll let you stay a minute. But I could get you if I really wanted to. Phew. Thank you, Larry. But I don't want you to pick on me. Most of the time, when people offer advice, they're not picking on you. They're really doing their best to help you. Doesn't that sound reasonable? Well... I guess so. Sure. And almost all of us need to learn and use good manners. What's so special about good manners, anyway? What do you want me to do? Curtsy when I come to school? Larry, good manners were never invented to make anyone look silly. Good manners show our consideration for the feelings of other people. To help us, we have rules that we follow. Rules of good behavior. Do you understand, Larry? Well, then, if people are going to live and work together, don't you agree that we should have rules? or manners to guide them in the way they treat each other? Good, Larry. I can see that you're beginning to get the idea. Now, I don't intend to pick on you, Larry, but let's go back to your behavior in class. It's all 
always bad manners when you don't pay attention to your teacher. She's there to help you, and it's bad manners to distract your classmates. Look at it this way, Larry. If you had something to say, wouldn't you want the others to listen? All right, then. There's something to remember. Improve your manners by being a good listener. Now, another little thing that happened rude when you made fun of Alice's picture. Of course, you were just kidding. You were just showing off. But Alice didn't know that you were just kidding. Larry, it's always wrong to make fun of other people, even if it's just a gag. That goes for their work, their appearance, anything. It's bad manners to hurt other people's feelings. I'm sorry, Chalky. I didn't mean to hurt her feelings. Should I apologize? It's always good manners to say you're sorry when you've done something wrong. Oh, by the way, do you remember what happened just before recess? Larry. Larry Carson. Yeah? It's almost time for recess, Larry. I just wanted to remind you... It's extremely bad manners to show disrespect for your teacher by answering, yeah. Chalky, I guess I have been pretty bad. Tell me what else I did. Larry, I think we can forget about what you've done. Let's talk about what you could do. I've got an idea, Chalky. If I knew good manners, I could use them. Maybe you could make a list of good manners in school. Say, that is a good idea. Let's make it together. Hold on there. You just tell me what you want to write. Well, first, manners in school. Hey, that's neat. How'd you do it? Nothing to it. Now, what's the first good manners rule? Let's see. One, pay attention in class. Two, don't distract others. And three, don't make fun of other people or do anything to hurt others. Right. And how about this one? Be respectful to your teacher. And always answer, yes, Miss Rand, or no, Miss Rand. Never, yeah, or uh-uh. Okay. And here are some more. Take your turn in class or play. Keep your desk neat and tidy. Say, don't forget, be on time. There, that's a pretty good list. Let's see. Pay attention in class. Don't make fun of people. Don't do anything to hurt others. Be respectful to your teacher. Take your turn in class or play. Keep your desk neat and tidy. Be on time. Is that all? Of course not, Larry. You'll have to keep looking for new ones and putting them on your list. Say, I just thought of another one. Any idea what it would be? No, I don't. What is it, Chalky? Always do your share. Does that remind you of anything? Oh, my gosh. I'm supposed to be cleaning the chalkboard. Be sure to do a good job, Larry. One of the finest things that can be said of anyone is that he does the very best he can. Hey, look out. I almost erased you. <laughs> Just a few minutes ago, I thought that's what you wanted to do. I'm ready to go, Larry. Aw, oh, gee. No, Chalky. I can't do that. I need you to help me with my manners. No, Larry. You don't need me anymore. You can learn good manners yourself by watching the good manners of others. You can get all the help you want from your parents, your friends, from your teacher. Once they know that you want to have good manners, they'll be glad to help you with them. Besides, how can you clean the board with me hanging around? So long, Larry. So long, Chalky. Don't forget, in school and everywhere else, mind your manners.
Larry. You've done an excellent job on the chalkboard. Thank you, Miss Rand. Well, you're welcome, Larry. Thank you.